Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can set up the Samsung Galaxy S22 series for the first time. So before we begin, just insert the nano SIM card into the SIM tray. And here I will put in, put on the SIM card onto the SIM tray, make sure the metal contact is facing up. And then we're going to insert it into the SIM slot right here. Now when you insert, the SIM tray may slip out of place, so you can push the SIM tray up a little bit to keep the SIM card in place and then push it all the way in. The SIM tray is plastic, so be careful, don't push it too hard. You might break it. Next, we're gonna press on the side button to power on the device. Right here, press and hold for a few seconds to switch on your device. Okay, so once we are at the welcome screen, First, choose your language and region, and then tap on the Start button. Next, in here, tap on Agree to All. This is optional. Uh, you need to agree to End User License Agreement. Uh, other options are optional. I'm going to um, agree on the Privacy Policy, and then tap on Agree. So tap on Agree, you go to the next screen. In the Permissions for Samsung Apps and Device, Turn on or off any features that you want to use or don't use. So here we've got the continuity service. Phone, use to answer or decline calls using your earbuds. You can use, you can customize service for calendar and call logs. Then you can tap on more. So I'm going to leave this as the default. They are all uh, switch on by default and then uh, tap on agree. Next, we need to connect to a Wi-Fi network. So tap on your Wi-Fi. Now put in your Wi-Fi password. Okay, put in the Wi-Fi network and tap on connect. And then tap on next. And now it said service provider setup. Check in service provider information. This could take a few minutes. Okay, at this point, it says my device needs to restart, so I'm going to tap on the restart button. Okay, once the phone turn on, it will say, do you want to copy apps and data from your old device to the new device? If you do want, you can tap on the next button. Now, because I want to make this video quick, so I'm going to choose don't copy. And this will set up your device at a fresh uh, device and uh, say check info okay now say getting your phone ready so just wait for a few minutes now next you need to sign into your Google account um, once you sign into Google account you will be able to download apps you can choose to do it now or you can skip so it's just um, for the purpose of a quick video I'm going to choose skip and then tap on skip for now. We can always go into settings and then sign in from settings. Now tap on more and then tap on accept. Next, it asks you do you want to protect your phone by setting up face recognitions, fingerprints, pattern, pin or password, or you can just skip it all together and you can uh, set it up in settings. I'm going to choose skip for now and tap on skip anyway. And that's again your phone ready again. Okay, on the next screen, it says get, get recommended apps. And it's got essential apps on my device here, my network carrier, and Amazon Shopping. I'm not sure why this is even on here. Uh, maybe we, perhaps I need to go on to Amazon to buy the charger because this device does not come with a charger. So we're gonna tap on next. And then now you can sign into your Samsung account or you can skip for now. It is uh, a good idea to sign into your Samsung account because then you can uh, lock your device and if you lose your device, you can use uh, the Find My Mobile to locate your lost device. I'm going to skip for now and tap on skip and you can see if you skip that, you will miss out all of these services. So I would highly recommend you sign in to your Samsung account. And that's it. Let's say now you're all set up. I'm going to tap on the finish button. 
And here we are at the home screen on the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra. Now, as soon as we go to the home screen, it asks us, it shows us the SIM card manager. In here, I have one SIM card already uh, inserted. I can add in an additional uh, SIM by using the eSIM, which I can add in the mobile plan. And that's it. Now I can tap on done to get out of that SIM manager. And from the home screen, you can immediately start to make calls, uh, use the internet if you have connected to Wi-Fi, or if your SIM card has uh, uh, data in it. And uh, you can swipe down at the top to go into settings. So you can see while you can go to the home screen, uh, your phone is still trying to uh, set up on the background. Then you can tap on settings up here to go into settings. And then from here, you can uh, sign to your Samsung account. Or you can sign to your Google account by going down to the account section. And in here, you can uh, add the Google account in here. And that's it. That is how you can quickly uh, set up your Samsung Galaxy S22 series. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.